Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm doing another journaling video, journal with me thingy, um, and also answering some questions that I got on my Tumblr. Um, also before I start, I wanted to say that the supplies and stuff are going to be linked in my description. Some of them, like the stickers, are from my shop, um, so I'll link to those if you want them as well. Um, anyways, so the first question is, how do you get the motivation and inspiration and I'm guessing the question is relating to journaling. Um, I'd say most of it comes within and from my desire to document things and document my feelings. Um, I kind of go off of that and then things that continue to inspire me are music, nature, other people's journal spreads, photography, things like that. Um, so yeah. The next question was what made you want to start keeping a journal? And I would say that Again, I just like to document. I've kept a diary since I was a little girl, basically. Um, that kind of turned into a journal, I guess. So yeah, I just like to look back on how I was feeling or thinking in a certain point in time. Um, and I also just like to release my emotions onto paper. It's just something that I like to do, I guess. Are there times where you can't keep up with journaling? And if so, what do you do to start again? Uh, that's the next question. And yeah, definitely this past summer, actually the whole summer, it was kind of hard for me to journal. Um, and what do I do to start again? I just kind of, I, I let myself do other creative things first and I try and journal if I can. And if I can't, then I try again some other time. I just don't like to put too much pressure on myself when it comes to doing that. Um, and the last question on here that I'll answer for today is how do you deal with being overwhelmed and how do you prevent it beforehand in terms of academia and just life in general? Um, I can definitely make a whole different video on this topic on how I deal with it personally, but basically I kind of give myself a reset and I kind of start over with a lot of things. I'll either like clean my room or reorganize my room or clean my digital space or delete things off my phone so I just kind of like to do that and then it puts me in a better headspace to think clearly I guess but anyways that's all the time I have for now um, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time bye